Celebration, the double fist pump from the coach standing up. He's a time out, he's saying he's all over it. Chris Fagan tonight. Um, I think the one thing that Fags has brought to the club um, since he's arrived is a real um, care about people. Uh, ever since he's got to the club, he's had open and honest relationships with both staff and players. Um, and it hasn't been necessarily about football, it's been about outside life, um, family members, um, and he's just brought a real care and family culture to our team that um, I think the boys have really uh, thrived off. And when a person invests so much time into you personally, um, and not necessarily just worrying about your football, you just want to play for him. And um, I think uh, what we've been able to do over the past four years is built heavily off, off what he's brought to the club. Yeah, well, I guess Fags is a bit of a father figure for a lot of us boys. Um, you know, he's just brought in a, a great culture into the group. Um, he's extremely caring and, uh, you know, he's, he's also extremely competitive, but he, but he mixes it really well and, um, you know, sort of provides us, us with, a, with the best of both worlds in terms of his personality. Uh, from the first time he walked into the place, uh, I think what he's been able to bring is real calmness to the uh, to the group, not only players but coaches. He made it a real safe environment for everyone to come to. It was one of the first things I think he uh, he wanted to achieve in his time here. Just uh, the ability for, for players and staff to be able to walk into the club and feel like they're in a safe environment has had great trust in his coaching group. Uh, he's allowed them to make decisions on their own without uh, him checking up on them. He's got great belief in standards that not only he's created but the playing group and the leadership group have created in the organisation which has enabled us to um, you know, be a, a team that finished last on the ladder in 2017 to basically play in final series the last two years, playing in a preliminary final last year which has been an enormous achievement when, when you think about the progression of it all. I think the main thing that Fags has brought to the group is just um, promoting everyone to be themselves, um, be, how they, be how they are sort of off the field. Um, you know, we've got, a, we've got a lot of different characters and uh, he really promotes that, no one gets shut down. So it's a great environment to be a part of and he's, he's been a massive reason as to why that is. Uh, and, and on field it's the same thing, he, he wants you to bring your flair, um, he encourages us all the way to, to take the game on and, and doesn't mind if we make mistakes. So he, he's just a great coach and a, a great figure for all of us to have around. Uh, Fags has got a couple of um, famous quotes, but there's no doubt the one that's resonated with the boys the most is his ability to make it into an arm wrestle. Um, he's done that a number of times in our team meetings, gets a laugh every time, um, and it's more referencing that you've got to win the game multiple times. So this one's for you, Fags.